All right, I am at 21158 Coachman. This home sits on a corner. And um, just so you can see the neighborhood here. There is a sheriff's car that I've seen parked about four houses down. Um, here is drainage. Um, there's a hill. I don't know if you can see it in the video as well, but any rainwater would run off over this way. And then, of course, around this way. Um, driveway is not as nice as Walton. It's just a little cracked and a um, lot of places. Just want to point that out. I, mean, I just want to point out everything so that you guys can see things how I'm seeing them. This roof is 2021, she said. Solar panels are 2022. I'm going to find out if those are owned or leased. Looks like the outside is nicely painted. It's got some cute shutters and all of the windows have been done. I just have to check to see if they are hurricane or not. Um, here is the two car garage. It has a little dent right there. And um, it does have this shed on the side. <clears throat> I guess I didn't show Jamie this. Oh, it needs to be pulled back down there. Um, I guess that would be nice to store like beachy things. There's the AC. Got to double check on the year of that. It's very sandy. There's some like little ant holes, but yeah, we've got like sandy soil. Um, this storm door. This door here. Walking in it, this is the front living room. I think it could use a quick coat of paint everywhere to kind of get a, get some of these blemishes away. But the ceiling is um, like a swirly pattern. So Coming straight in, there's the living room here, and then going this way is the garage. So here's the garage door. This actually looks like it could be painted. Water heater looks older. Um, washer and dryer would go here in the garage. There is not one right now. Um, and then there's this little lip here. Let's make sure this opens. access so it's a it says it's a dual power supply yes with the solar And then coming back in. Kitchen here, but you know, before we go there, there's a, like a linen closet here or extra storage. And then right here would be the master bedroom. Here there's like a painted popcorn, but it's painted nice. Actually, this room is painted pretty nice. This room probably doesn't need any paint. Um, you might want to do new blinds and then here's like a curtain rod, no blinds, but definitely newer windows. And then, uh, well, I guess I should just show you here. This floor is pretty much throughout 
And then uh, this is a different type of flooring. There's just a teeny little lip right there. Teeny. Um, and then here you get to the master bathroom. There's a sink here. These seem newer. They're slow closed cabinets. And then to the right here is the bathroom. This door goes out. It's a pretty skinny door. I don't know if you'd ever use it. And uh, this bathroom is painted okay. And then here's the shower. Probably just some new caulking. Otherwise, okay. Some of uh, the popcorn's coming off right there. Um, these little thingies might be changed out. I don't know. Some of them are changed out, some of them aren't. This looks newer. Yeah, these look new on the inside. And then there's a, this pocket door. They didn't paint that though. Um, but on the inside of this walk-in closet is all painted except for, well, kind of. Sliding glass door goes out to the covered lanai area and pool. And then this slider here in the master is newer. Coming out this way is the kitchen. And you know, the appliances look new. Stove looks new. Looks like it's never been used. Uh, the refrigerator looks newer. Uh, I'm not sure if it was used or not. And then uh, the dishwasher is older. It's like a cream color. Let me get these lights. They, there's recessed lights here. So they took out, oh, there's a patch there that they didn't patch all the way. But that's probably like the electrical box where uh, they had those funky lights. These, I think, are newer. They, they're slow close. And everything looks kind of newer. And, uh, you know, it looks like there were cabinets up here that they took out at some point. Then there's the dining room. That opens up to this living room. And uh, I don't know what happened here. There might have been a built-in bookcase or something and they took it out and had to redo the tile right there. But I think that you guys would probably put an entertainment center right here and it would cover that up. Then on this side of the house are the two other bedrooms. This one has a another tile flooring in it, mirror closet. Um, looks like they scraped the popcorn in here. And then this bedroom here, um, it has like a wood laminate and popcorn in here painted. And then here's the secondary bathroom that these two bedrooms would share. Looks like they updated the vanity. This is like a, a laminated countertop, but it looks nice. And then, um, bathtub there. This is, this should be a linen closet with some shelves, but there's no shelves or hooks or anything in there. And so all the windows and sliders look like they've been done except for this triple slider. Slides pretty easy. And that one does pocket in and it has like a reflective um, coating on it so it doesn't bring the sun into the house 
So that opens all the way, which is nice. And, um, and then the pool, I say it's trapezoidal. So it's bigger at this end. Yeah, there's some stains on it. I don't know if that can be cleaned or not. And then it gets a little skinnier towards that end. Um, you know, if you paint it on the inside, you could probably repaint the outside decking all the way, make it all the same color. There are some cracks here. Um, that's normal for decking. And then, you know, some rust, which I think comes from these things, which could be sprayed with Rust-Oleum. But every single lanai gets this. Overall, the, the cage looks good. There's not, I mean, this is like a great patch. I don't know if you could see it, but whenever you do get it like a little hole, they have this screen patch. Um, but the, I mean, overall the screen looks good. So doggy door, there's, this is missing the little uh, hinge there. And then coming out, they've got a um, pool heater. Pool equipment. It's got the privacy gate, vinyl gate. There's a, this probably happened from a branch or something. And then And it looks like they've started taking it down, actually. I don't know if this was damaged from the hurricane or what. I mean, it's, it's cracked, but still works. And then this door right here is the door from the master bathroom that comes out. I don't think you'd ever use it. So there's some questions I'm going to ask about this one and let me know if you have any other questions about this one. But from what I can tell, you know, this one would need some paint here on the pool deck and some paint in some of the rooms in here and maybe some updated lighting, maybe a new dishwasher um, and, you know, replacing some of these at some point. But overall, Looks nice. I like that it has the newer roof, the newer windows. Alrighty.